Hey guys, it's Sam and I haven't done a haul video in a very long time and I've kind of put some stuff into a corner to share with you and it's just a random random bunch of stuff. So let's get started. The first is this face mask from Tory Burch. So there came five in a pack. I actually got this for my sister from the Tory Burch website because she had mentioned it and her birthday was coming up so I felt I would get her uh, the set of five and she said pick one out and uh, we decided that I would have this one and it's so pretty and they feel so soft and nice and I just show you compared to my face how it the sizing how it looks so fits really nice and I do have a smaller face but because it's smaller um, well, because my face is smaller, it like covers more real estate on my face. Um, and it feels really, really nice. So I highly recommend these. Um, I haven't worn it out yet. So I actually, let me take that back. I recommend how they feel and look, but I haven't tested it wearing it outside. Um, next is related to the face mask. I wanted to get a chain. I know Bobble Bar had put out their chain, uh, but I... To test it out first, I got one from Amazon, and it's just this kind of gold, I think it's supposed to be rose gold, and you attach it to your, the mask, uh, the ears of the mask, and the ear hoops of the mask, and uh, it just makes it so much easier than putting it like on your wrist or, wrist or uh, putting it in your bag. You just let it hang in the front, and when I was eating at work, um, I would push it to the back. So really easy, makes it easier to um, have hold your mask and not get it kind of dirty or anything like that. And a way to remember that, oh yeah, wear your mask because it's just on you anyway. Um, so I got that from Amazon. Uh, next, uh, next few things are from Amazon. Uh, I got this Brita water filter bottle and I do have one. But I feel that is, I believe, a 32, no. So what I have must be an 18 ounce or 20 something ounce. This one is a 32 ounce. And when you see it, you're going to laugh because it looks so funny. So I got the stainless steel one because I figured it'll keep my water cooler. And I'm one of those people that my drinks have to be cold. So look at this thing. Um, I haven't tried it yet, but I will, uh, I'm working mostly from home, so I thought that that might help me drink more water because I definitely, definitely don't drink enough water. My wallet has, um, broken in the front. I've, I've had this wallet forever. You know what? Let me grab it so I can show you. Okay, so here is my current wallet. I love it. It's big. It fits a lot of stuff. But this started happening and I just needed a new wallet. And I want I like to get the kind that has the RFID protection, which is people can't scan your credit cards or anything. So I got the same brand because that wallet has lasted me for a long time. And it is Travel, Travel Ambo or Travel Ambo. And I've been really into, well, I've always liked the, like, kind of, like, blush colors. And I saw this one, and you just never know what you're going to get in terms of color. Like, it might be slightly different, but this is exactly what I wanted. It's so pretty. It's coming off, I think, more beige, but there is a pink, like, blushy color to it. So, um, let me open it up. You get lots and lots of pockets and room for cards and um, I like that this has a clasp in there to open and more card space. So really happy about how this looks. I will transfer it, my wallet, my old wallet to this new wallet soon. And then the last thing from Amazon, I think, out of this haul that I'm showing you this part of the haul are the sports bras I am currently wearing there's a gray one and you get also a white which the white um 
this might not bother a lot of people, but when you wear the stretch, so there's cups, cup inserts in here, which I really like. Uh, but when you stretch it out, can you see that? You can see through, which I don't love that much. So I wish this was a thicker material, but I wear this mostly um, lounging around during the day or when I'm sleeping. So that's not too bad. And then the black one. And these are super comfortable. I'm on the bigger end. <laughs> on the bigger end. That sounded so I was going to say I'm on the bigger end of uh, like chest sizing. But um, I mean, that's true. And these are very comfortable. My boobs aren't going like up and down or anything like that. So I would highly recommend these. The brand is, oh gosh, what's it say? Miriti. M-I-R-I-T-Y and for reference I got the extra large so I believe the sizing you could just look up your bra size and you know they do the correlation so extra large is perfect for me so next is Daiso and we went there uh, so today is October and we went there this past weekend Tuesday October 6th uh, we went there the past weekend for my sister's birthday we don't get to go to Daiso that often so it's kind of like a surprise treat for her um, and it's just a, I feel like a nicer version of like a five below or something like that I picked up this is probably the only makeup item it's this brow uh, eyebrow gel not that I need another one, but I thought I like I have to I want to get a makeup item, so I got this, and then uh, for so I have the vanity, uh, the Hollywood vanity mirror, and the bulbs get so dusty, so I thought I I pick the I would pick up this little one, and see if I can keep the dust at bay because. If I could, maybe if I keep this on my vanity area, it'll remind me to dust, which, and I'm allergic to dust mites, so I should really be doing that. Uh, who doesn't need a clear box with a handle? So, got that, and I'm saying so a bazillion times already. I apologize. Um, here, secure, like, closure. And I thought I would put... Um, since I am working from home a lot, I thought I would put my markers and maybe art supplies in here. Haven't figured out exactly what to do with that yet. Also picked up these Choco and Coffee Biscuits, and they're the cutest size. Let me just show you. I'm not going to have one now, but they're not too big. Look at that compared to... So nice little, so, 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 I wish I had a zapper every time I said it, <laughs> teach myself not to say that word a bazillion times, and normally I would edit all that stuff out, well, actually, I don't edit that much, uh, I would just refilm everything, but I'm gonna, I'm not gonna do that. Love this stuff, it's the LA's Totally Awesome. I will use this kind of like for the oven because it gets so dirty no matter what. And I do do a lot of cooking uh, and I feel like this works really well. And the last thing that I got from Daiso is the sponge and brush cleaner. I do like the, the beauty blender, the, the soap bars, you know, the circle ones. I just feel like it's harder to use and I thought this might be a little bit easier so I'm excited to try that out and it's not a complete haul without something from Old Navy I didn't get everything but I did want to get this haul up so I'm just gonna film it now I love their t-shirts and I got this one and it's a Satchel Liberty and it says NYC and a red heart and I just love New York, so I thought this was cute and not something that was too flashy or anything like that. And they were doing uh, a sale on jeans. Well, they're always having some sort of sale, but I thought it was worth it this time to get a few pairs of jeans. And I have this one, um, and I love it so much that I got another one. It's the Rockstar Super Skinny High Rise Secret Slim Pockets. And normally I get... And I love this. 
I got it because I like this stone wash. I really do. And uh, they're just super comfortable and feel like really well constructed. So I'm glad to have another one. And yeah, loving this color. And then here is another pair of rock stars. These are the, I feel like these are the same, but see, they're the same, but different color, different wash. And I like the medium to darker washes. I do have one pair of really light jeans that I love, but I don't get that color that often. I really, really love high-rise jeans, so that's why both of those jeans were high-rise. They go over the muffin top, they flatten and smooth, and uh, for the price, I think the stone wash ones were, were less than 20 bucks, even maybe like 16 or $17, which I think for a pair of jeans is really good. And like I said, it feels really well made. Uh, next are a few things from Lowe's, or let's see here, yeah. Uh, got this from my grandmother. Sorry, this is not exciting stuff. Uh, it's a window air conditioner cover for outside because we're trying to. So she has two windows. One where we put in the air conditioner. Uh, this house doesn't have central air. And then, uh, normally we would take it out, and it's just kind of a hassle to keep on taking it out and putting it in, taking it out. So we also got uh this Frost King window installation kit so you just cover the window and that way you don't have to take out the ac we'll try it for the first time if it doesn't work then you know it didn't work and i've been wanting to line dry my clothes outside we keep we have a sorry for that if you hear that noise it's my computer i don't know what it's doing uh so we have um a drying rack downstairs but i feel like the both basement the basement holds a lot of like moisture so the clothes take forever to dry and i thought why don't we get a clothes clothesline for outside and i got this one and this is from amazon i forgot i ordered this from amazon but it's just one of these you attach it and you just dry your clothes on here and i'm excited to <laughs> dry my clothes outside <laughs> and I also picked up these it says bag clips but you couldn't use them to hang your clothes outside and I thought those were so fun and colorful and if this all again if this doesn't work out I'll have these for something else it could be used for uh, this came I believe with these and we are nearing the home stretch this is the last a few things I'm going to share with you. It's from Costco. That place, I've had to physically, like, not go there. Um, like, tell myself, you can't go there. Like, I go either once a month or maybe every six weeks because we spend so much money there. Even, I do follow a list, but there's just so much other goodies to get. And so I picked up, this is the Fannie Mae S'more Snack Mix. I thought this looked really good. So you get crunchy grams and fluffy marshmallows coated in milk chocolate. That sounds really good. So, um, there I go with the soap. <laughs> this video is crazy. Uh, and then, oh, you know what? There's, oh, I got these, uh, vitamin D. It's especially important right now since um, a lot of us are working from home. Uh, vitamin, D, vitamin D is associated with uh, like depression if you don't get enough and just your body in general. So I got these because I am running low. And I thought this looked really interesting. I know this, I've passed by this several times. Uh, it's the Kirkland Moisture Shampoo and Conditioner. And not that my hair is particularly dry, but I thought it would be fun to try a new... It does get kind of frizzy and stuff. I thought it would help with that. And I'm try, excited to try a new shampoo and conditioner. Also refilled on um, contact solution and got just the regular old Kirkland brand. And... 
this is a, a gift for my grandmother uh, for the winter time. She's always cold. I'm sure for those of you that live with elderly uh, parents or grandparents or no older seniors, uh, they're always cold no matter what. And I got her, I ha she has a couple of these already and she really likes them. So I got her uh, this one. I don't believe she has the gray one and it comes with gray and white. And then the very, very last thing are from Aldi. I We went to Costco and there was an Aldi nearby and I needed to get a few things. So I can't get everything at Costco. It's just too big, too big for our small family of four. And um, the refrigerator, we, our refrigerator is very tiny. Uh, but I did go to Aldi just to pick up last minute things. And I've heard this about this brand. I thought it was no longer sold. So and I've been wanting to try this brand for a long time. I kind of forgot about it. I'm talking about years and years. Uh, it's the La Cura brand. And I picked up the Cleansing Exfoliating Scrub. The Foaming Gel Cleanser. And they also had the, the Day Cream. And the Night Cream. And let me just open the day cream so you can kind of see for size. There you go. I'm excited to try these uh, out because back way, way, way back, I heard a few people talking about that brand. And uh, I, whenever I went to an Aldi, I could never find it. I believe they were phasing it out. But now it seems like they're kind of back or this Aldi had it. And that, my friends, is the end of the haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you're doing well. And uh, I will talk to you soon. Bye.